What's up guys, my name is Technobber here for Troubleshoot and today I've got a super simple fix for a super obscure issue that some people have been having and recently I've stumbled across a solution to it, though it wasn't the best explained so here I am doing my best job. So if you open up CSGO and all of a sudden your mic jumps from this volume to three times this volume and everyone of the Discord or TeamSpeak is crying about your microphone being super loud, you have to go into your little sound options down here sound settings, head into sound control panel, recording tab, select the microphone, properties, levels, and turn it down here, then this is the issue that's affecting you. As far as I know, it only affects the slider over here, and it's super simple to fix. So either ways, let's say I have this on 60%. As soon as I start up CS, it'll be back to 100%. And no matter what you do, what you'll have to do is tab out and turn it down here in order to fix it. Though that's a temporary fix, and of course, not the best. So, anyways, let's get into the actual fix. Number one, head across to where Steam is installed. I'll simply just find the Steam icon on my desktop, right click, open file location, and then I'm in this folder over here with Steam and the rest of them. What we'll do is we'll scroll down and find user data. Then we'll double click on it and we'll have a bunch of folders. If you have only one folder here, then great. Otherwise, you'll have to go ahead and find out which one is for which account. And I've heard before that these are your Steam ID, and while that's partially true, you may be confused on how to get there. So if there's only one folder over here, you can check the description down below for a timestamp, skip to the one on the screen, or use the play bar at the bottom of the video. Otherwise, if you don't know which one is your current account, and you'd like to find out, simply head across to Steam, then click your profile in the top right, and go to View My Profile. Then when you're on this page, right-click, copy page URL. Next up, we'll open up a browser and we'll head across to steamid.uk. At the very top, you can paste it into this search bar or you can use this search bar down here. Anyways, just click the search button. Then once the page loads, we'll see something like this. This may be a little bit different because I'm signed into the website. Either way, scroll down, you should see the account's name, a profile picture and Steam IDs over here. What we're gonna do is look at Steam 3 and we'll focus on this last group of numbers here. We can ignore U and 1. Looking at this last grouping of numbers, 104-322-402. I'll look back at the folder here and we'll see 104-322-402. Though of course, your number will be different. Double clicking on it, we'll have a list of games and game configs. Simply double click on 730, then local, config, then find config.cfg, double click and open it with notepad or notepad plus plus, and we'll hit control F, then we'll search for voice underscore mixer underscore volume as such, and we'll be taken to this over here, voice mixer volume. Then we'll look inside of the inverted commas over here, and we'll enter a new number, 1.0 being 100% and 0.0, .0 being 0%. What you want to do is head back to that control panel that we were at earlier. So right clicking the sound icon, sound settings, sound control panel, then heading across to the recording tab, finding your device, right click properties, levels, and we'll see the number over here. Though of course, if yours isn't a percentage, i.e. 0 to 100, right click on this little text box and click percentage. Yours might look like this. Then we'll take this number, divide it by 100, and we'll enter it here with a trailing decimal, i.e. 0, just make sure there is a point in it. So say that you're at 60%, you'll enter 0 0.6, or 63%, you'd enter 0 0.63. Once you've found the correct volume, you can go ahead and save the file. I leave mine at 1, so file, save, close. Then the next time you open up your game, your microphone shouldn't be deafening everyone in a 10 kilometer radius of you. Anyways, that's about it. My name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoot, hopefully this video helped you, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!